How are you guys doing? Welcome back uh, to another video. So we've got ourselves a another icon moment, of course. Uh, goalkeeper this time. Uh, they always tend to do well. Uh, Peter Schmeichel. And yeah, it's a, it's a nice boost, I think, from the Prime version. Just from using uh, the card, I can tell you. I'm um, also using from the Prime version. Uh, I can definitely tell you that this card feels much, uh, much better. Um, you can definitely feel significant improvement in my opinion particularly in that shot stopping uh, of course and yeah i actually had a lot of fun with the uh the card and yeah i mean i've never really been too impressed with schmeichel generally throughout the years i feel like he's kind of just that keeper you know he doesn't really warrant the extra price the value of an icon goalkeeper you know he kind of just is there um doesn't really do anything extra does the fundamentals correctly but you know he doesn't make those big stops that will win you games but with this Schmeichel I found that he actually uh, was capable of doing that a lot more um, now he does lack consistency uh, very much um, you know he'll either have a really really good game uh, there were a lot of instances where he had a nine point uh, or higher um, but then there were games where he literally just didn't make saves at all um, and had like you know under 5.0 so yeah the consistency I mean I guess that really applies to every goalkeeper in the game but yeah this guy is the literal definition of inconsistency so that's something you can definitely definitely expect uh with this guy but yeah schmeichel's not really a keeper uh you see too often when it comes to the icon goalkeepers actually uh, in general you know you usually the, the favorites are usually Sh what petr Cech and van der sar i know van der sar is definitely probably the biggest one um also yashin of course there's always hype around yashin also with the hat uh, Casillas as well, because he is a newer uh, icon, of course, and, you know, he's got some great stats. Um, but yeah, Schmeichel's not one you traditionally see too often, and he's not really uh, talked about. Um, but I feel like this year, this guy could definitely be a more viable option in terms of your icon selection. Um, so yeah, I guess a good starting point. Like I said, the shot stopping, a big improvement. And I thought the strongest area was the diving. Uh, he has 93 diving. And I thought when it came to mid-range or higher um, across goal shots, very consistent and keeping those out. And um, I just, I think, yeah, just the general diving. He has really good uh, diving animations. Uh, the reflexes as well. He has 95 re, uh, yeah, reflexes, 89 reactions. Um, and yeah, he, he was very impressive in a lot of instances when it came to close range, uh, point blank. Uh, and very responsive in a lot of situations, you know, so uh, you can see I think I noted when it came to rebounds um, Which he actually gave up quite a bit, you know, he's his handling is very questionable um, And when it comes to parrying uh, he does You know often give chances uh, for that rebound which was a little frustrating but fortunately enough um, he actually made up for a lot of those um, errors uh, like I said with those reflex saves those reactions you can see there were a couple um, Instances that were really really impressive um, that not a lot of keepers uh, will You know make so yeah, I thought the uh, general shot stopping diving reflex saves uh, Very good, um, but yeah that parrying can be something of an issue um, In those in those top divisions against those really good uh, opponents with you know good shot selections um, and then you have, like I said, the handling. Um, not, like I said, the parrying is questionable, but also off like crosses, I did notice, or even an aerial, um, the aerial ball. Um, I felt that he punched the ball a lot instead of actually catching it. So uh, the ball retention, um, he wasn't great with. You know, you don't always win possession as you would hope for with the goalkeeper um, when there is contested forwards in the air you know he often likes to punch it away um, either out for a corner or just high up in the air so that is something I also thought was unique about the card which I didn't necessarily like and then the positioning which was generally pretty good um, maybe the only problem would be you know if someone ran to the byline sweat it back uh, he did shift his body very far um, across and then maybe leaving his near post a little exposed but yeah I thought uh I thought it was a really good card. I, I actually was really impressed. I don't usually love Schmeichel in the game, but I thought this year, or, or this time, uh, he he did well for me. And uh, that shot stopping 
was really impressive. So yeah, that's going to be my review. Please like, of course, subscribe, comment down below who you'd like to see next. And thank you for watching.